In today's video, I'll be showing you a new method that you can use to help you create high quality SEO optimized articles quickly using ChatGPT and Harpa.ai. Harpa.ai is a very powerful ChatGPT extension which allows you to do a variety of different tasks. But in today's video, I'll be using it specifically to help us create high quality SEO optimized articles. So let's go ahead and get started. So to get started, add the Harpa.ai Google Chrome extension onto your browser. I'll leave a link in the description below for Harpa.ai. And once you've added in onto your Google Chrome extension, you want to go ahead and search up the keyword in which you're trying to create an article for. So let's say we wanted to write an article about how to become a better listener and how to become a better listener is also the target keyword that we're going after and the keyword in which we're trying to rank for. So what you want to do is head over to Google, search up that keyword. So we'll be going through some of the top ranked articles for this specific keyword to figure out what topics what keywords and what questions we need to include within those articles to start ranking on Google. Now, what we had to do is without the extension, we would have to manually go through all of this content and then try to pull out the most important information. And once you're on your top ranked blog post for that specific keyword, hit the control A button. And again, that will pull up the Harper AI extension. And we want to extract um, all of the most important keywords and all of the most important metrics for this specific article. And if you were to manually do this, this would take a lot of time. It'd be very tedious. But again, this makes it very easy for us to pull that information using the Harper extension. So again, just hit the slash button and we can search up SEO. We can search our keywords again, um, and this will give you a bunch of different commands and prompts that you can use with this new extension. So for this workflow, we'll be using the extract and research SEO keywords. So we can either paste the competitor's article up to 3000 symbols, or we can just go ahead and press enter and um, it will figure out that we're on this specific page. And as you can see here, we're getting a nice um, outline or a nice um, sort of keyword density report for this specific article. So this is one um, example of the article content which we get back. So we can copy this over and head over to ChatGPT and paste this in there so that we're saving all of our information. Okay, so we'll go ahead and paste this within the system. And I am using the playground mode. I prefer this mode a lot better because I believe the results are much more high quality compared to using the web app. So now let's go ahead and do the same thing for a second blog post that's ranking for this specific keyword. And again, we're gonna hit the control A and we're going to try to pull some of the most important information from this web page. So again, we'll be using the extract and research SEO keywords. We're gonna click enter and it'll pull all of the most important information from this specific blog post. And we're going to copy this over again and we're going to paste this into our playground mode so we're just going to go ahead and uh, repeat this process for at least five of the top ranked articles because we'll have a nice list of keywords that we can then use to create our seo optimized article another relevant prompt that you can use is the topical authority prompt so this creates a table with article ideas to help you build topical authority so once you've selected that prompt you need to then describe what your main article is about or a search keyword so again we'll enter the keyword which is how to become a better listener and what this is going to do is it's going to give us um, some related um, keywords that we can use within our articles to increase our topical authority so now let's go ahead and paste this in but we're going to label it as topical authority Okay, so let's go back and use the extract and um, research SEO keywords. Okay, so we've run that for this specific article. And again, let's go back up here, paste this in here. So as you can see, there's a variety of different prompts in which you can use with um, Harpo to help you really get the most important information that you need for a specific keyword. And this makes it so much easier than using Surfer SEO or another paid content optimization tool. You can do all of your content research within Harpo and then use ChatGPT to write your content. And just before we continue the video, I'd like to let you guys know of a new service that I'll be offering, and that is creating high quality SEO optimized blog posts for any niche. So if you like the strategies that I mentioned in today's video, and you would like me to create some blog posts for you, just head over to the link in the description below this video, select whichever package you like, fill out the form, and then I'll be in contact with you and we can finalize the order. Let's continue with today's video. A couple other prompts in which you can use are the keyword report. This creates a keyword report and SEO content plan from one keyword. Keyword strategy generator provides a detailed strategy for any SEO keyword. You can segment your audience. You can create monthly or weekly content calendars. You can actually even write SEO articles using 
um, Harpa, but I like to combine it with ChatGPT or the Playground mode because I find that your results are a little bit better. Topical authority, SEO audit, keyword clusters, and so on. So let's actually go ahead and run a keyword report for this keyword, which is how to become Okay, so we got a keyword report. So again, I'm gonna copy this over and I'm gonna paste this into our keyword report section that I've created within the system. So again, we got a lot of information here. Um, you can probably stop at this point and start writing your article, but just to make sure that you guys really see the power of Harpa, let's go ahead and try another prompt that will be useful for this article. For this example, we'll be using the keyword strategy generator. So again, we're going to enter our keyword, which is how to become a better listener okay so here we get some faqs we get um, some related queries we get some long tail keywords and we also get some other keywords here so again a lot of information you can probably run one or two of these um, for this keyword and um, you would be able to use that for your article okay so we've entered a lot of information here within our system so now let's go ahead and have the ai write the full article using that information so the prompt is using this information within the system, again, this is a system, write an in-depth and comprehensive SEO optimized article about how to become a better listener. Remember to use all of the keyword data entered in the system so that the article is SEO optimized. Write in an engaging human-like style, always include tables and lists, and also always write in markdown format. So you don't really need to have a very comprehensive prompt especially when you've added in all of your information on the left hand side here the ai should be able to take that information and then um, use that to put it with into um, an article and for settings i'll increase the temperature up to one i've increased the maximum length and i'll be using the gpt4 model so let's go ahead and click submit and see what type of article we're able to get back okay so here is the full length article in which we're able to get back let's go ahead and see how long this content was doesn't seem like it was very long by any means so about 588 words so i would probably need to improve our prompt so that we're able to get better outputs or i probably needed to generate a outline first and then use that outline to generate um, the article because that seems to get us longer articles okay so i've asked it to follow the same format and keep the tables and lists expand this paragraph expand the article so it's 1500 words and continue writing in markdown format so again, let's go ahead and run this and try to get a longer article that we can actually um, compare with what is ranking for this specific keyword. Okay, so here's the expanded article in which we were able to get back, as you can see, a lot longer in terms of content compared to the first article. So let's go ahead and copy this over and we're gonna head over to New and Writer. Um, and I've already loaded up that keyword, which is how to become a better listener, because I wanna test to see what is your SEO optimization score using Harpa and ChatGPT and not actually using any content optimization tool. So let's go ahead and paste our content in here and see what is the score that we're able to get back. And it's not in um, H1 format, so we need to go ahead and add all of those tags. So give me one second. So after adding in our H1 and H2 tags, we have a score of 42, which is actually pretty good. Now let's go ahead and add a meta description. So I'm gonna head back over to um, the playground mode and I've asked it to create an SEO optimized title and meta description for this article. Okay, so we've added in our meta description and we have a score about 46. So of course you'd wanna do some more optimization to get this maybe to at least 60 or above. But as you can see here, it was really, really easy for us to um, create an SEO optimized article without having Having to invest or use a content optimization tool we used a free extension which was harpa.ai and then we just plugged all of that content into um, ChatGPT, and then we had it write the full article for us so this is great news because again you don't need to invest in a content optimization tool you can use these free extensions combine it with ChatGPT, and you'll have a pretty seo optimized article of course you may want to then go ahead and manually include some keywords uh, within your articles maybe add a faq section include some images and i'm sure you'll be able to get your score to a 60 or above but again this is a really really easy but effective method that you can use to help you create high quality seo optimized articles if you enjoyed today's video if you learned something new let it be known by giving us a big thumbs up and subscribing to the channel if you haven't already until next time stay well